Hi, welcome to KTV5 video tutorial. It's about variations of the storage compartment. I've used the same basic curves to create this one, which in my opinion looks better than this one, but it deviates from that form, of course. And I've got here an even smoother version, but this one deviates even more from this one. I will leave a link in the description for the original video here. So, let's have fun with Kitty V5. Okay, so that's the end of the original video. I've already inserted two new geometrical sets, one for variation 1 and one for variation 2. So, I don't need that surface. So, let's hide that join here. But I will need uh, the extrude, the original extrude, and some curves. So let's make those curves visible. The set. This looks okay. Yeah. Now let's extract two more edges. So go for extract. The propagation. Tangent would be OK. So select this edge, confirm, and another one, this one, and confirm. And now I can hide that surface. Great. Now I want to join these curves and those curves. So go for join, check, of course, tangency, select this curve that one and this one confirm and join those up there as well and now I can do another multi-section surface so let's go here select the first section select the second section reverse that direction so they point in the same direction and now go for the guides. This will be one guide, and that will be the next guide. And for the coupling, I want to go for tangency, then curvature, and confirm. And that would be the first variation, which in my opinion looks better, but it's a different form. Now let's activate this one and go for the second variation and hide that join here and those and that join and I will need this one and I need the original joins and the original trims not only this one and that one I show and I don't need the extract but only that corner here so in order to get a smoother surface I need smoother curves okay so let's smooth this curve here that corner so you go up to the join symbol and there you will find smooth curve or curve smooth. I want to smooth this one and I want it to be continuous in curvature. So those will be fixed here. Okay. I will need this one on the other side as well so I can translate this or I could use an extrude. So let's go for that translate. I want to translate this one. Direction will be that one. And the distance would be 470 millimeters. Nice. Now, if I had done the extrude, I could extract those edges but I can also 
draw lines. So go from tangent to curve to point to point and create an end point here. But first I have to smooth that curve. Or I could do it afterwards. Yeah, I will do it afterwards. So let's go from this end point to another end point over here. Confirm. And the same down below. Create another end point here. And the second one, create another end point over there. Confirm. Now let's do two joins. Join this here, that one, and this one. Confirm. And of course, check tangency. Okay. Then go for another join. This, this one, that one, and this one. Okay. And again, check tangency. Okay. Of course, they are tangent. And now I want to smooth this one and that one. So go again up here, go to smooth curve. This one here. Okay. And the other one up there. Confirm. And now let's hide. Take a look. So I forgot to put it onto curvature. Okay, this looks better. And now I can do another multi section surface. So go multi section, select this curve smooth, and that one, direction is okay. Go for the guides, this one and that one. And the coupling should be tangency and curvature. And confirm. And I've got my second variation. So I hope it was helpful. Hope you liked it. If you did like it, please give it a like or leave a comment. If you want to see more, please give it a like or leave a comment. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. That would very help be very helpful. You could follow me also on Facebook, Instagram, GrabCat and many more. Thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye bye.